a uh, been an emotional day for you know for, for me. Uh, I'm not used to this kind of days. You know, I'm part of the motorcycle industry, uh, bikers for Christ, and <clears throat> we you know like most of any type of organization, you know, whether it's you know ministry, you know RCMC. Uh, you know, outlaw, whatever. You know, we all have our Monday, you know, our monthly meetings. Uh, a lot of times we just call it church. Um, and for us, it works out well because we're doing it on Sundays. And, you know, we're, we're a faith based organization, so calling it church is appropriate. Uh, but right now, it's kind of a it was a bittersweet day because one of one of my our members is got stage four liver cancer. That's also uh, has moved to his pancreas and it's extraordinarily aggressive. And he's an amazing man. He wants to end his life with the same level of faith that he has lived his life. He's not asking for, for healing. He's asking for strength. And he made, made me very emotional Because, you know, we all, we, all of us within the biker ministry community, we know it's not about the passions on the back. It's about who can serve. And that's what truly matters. But at the same time, the bikers, the batch does have meaning. And, you know, it's not about, you know, we all know, all of us within the ministry, we know we, we work together. We never work against each other like, you know, in the MC world. We work together for one good cause, and that is to expand the kingdom of God. And, but he is, a, he's tidying up his affairs, preparing for his eternal life. And I am so happy for I'm sad that I'm happy. Because he's a brother. And today was his last time to be at one of our meetings. To be at church. That, that they are about to move to another state to start uh, his treatments for his cancer. Uh, they're hoping to be able to extend his life past six months right now. And so he started he's in the process of giving away his possessions, his belongings. He's been being very gracious to, him, to his brothers, giving away us very meaningful things for us. But as we've been dealing with this, it was also a joyful, very joyful day as a gentleman who's been riding with us for several months uh, is now a disciple. Uh, in the MC world, we call him a prospect. Uh, we're not an MC, so we, he's discipling with us. Uh, Got to, it was a, we, we've gotten to see many joyful things with him. He's got a beautiful young family, and you know he's trying to sh bring them, bring them right inside the, you know, the, with the Lord. His wife is now part of the a church, and he's teaching his his son and his uh, baby girl, you know, a better way. And. Got his name and uh, and 
you know, his support badge to put on his vest. And then he broke down in tears. Because, well, we're family. And it's always nice to be accepted as you in family.